So I'm here in the East End, the Ostend, in, uh, at the beach in Belgium. Nice pharaonic mansion here. Look at you know, oh, look at these pyramids all over. The, the obelisks are in gold. Still don't believe the pharaohs are ruling, eh? Yo, a gold obelisk, the symbol of the pharaonic domination. And, you know, lions, like the Sphinx, and the symbol of the aristocracy. It's called the Haus Maritza. I wonder where, that, where they got that from, the Maritza. Oh, uh, here, Maritza. Oh, there's the word Ri in it, it's for the sun. It's for the rest. And then inside here, I think this is the, uh, the Phoenix. Yeah. It's most certainly a Freemason Lodge. I'm not sure if you can see it. here at the sea in Belgium. The other side is England. <laughs> the sea. Oh, nice. It reminds me of the SA. South Africa. And this is the palace of the king here. That was that, uh, the obelisk thing there. Looks like the dome here. So, I snaked in here to the King's Summer Palace. That's where he's probably, you know, eating. But I'm not going to stand here too long. There's the sea. So, I'm heading back here. So, well, that's it, folks. Now, here's a statue, like, next to the King's Palace here, where his summer residence. Here are the black slaves there. There are the white slaves. Here's Isis. And there's the emperor, and here it says uh, to to his genius protector, the king. It's got a little square like in a computer. You can click on it, see some more on it. And here's a little square in, his, in the in the foot of the horse there. Same square. What, what does that mean? You know. So the emperor, the pharaoh said, you know, says he's a genius protector. Well, who is he protecting? He's protecting the per a. The big royal house, you're not protecting us. Get out of here. So, um, black slaves, white slaves, we're all the same. Oh, here in the king's Japanese garden, next to that nice message, we see the squares again, which are missing from the foot of the horse. And in the text there, next to this, um, the brilliant king, as he puts it out himself, yeah. And here's the other side of the hotel. Oh, where is it? No, you can't see it. Japanese garden. Don't know what's going on here, really. The only thing, well, it's of course it's the Trinity again. It's phallic, and the only thing I can think of this square is the base of a pyramid. Four elements. Uh, you know, just read this carefully. Yeah. Especially at the end, you know, they talk about the Pharaoh and and it says, you, we will not even remember how we once held the world in our hands and how we crushed it like a bird in our hands. Why do you want to crush a bird in your hands, man? The bird stands for liberty and they crush us. And we don't even remember who's ruling or we don't even know. Well, there's the king on his horse. You know, how he robbed Africa in the Congo. The, the palace is just behind. And this is called the Royal Astrid. Like a hotel, uh, where is it? Yeah, there. I think that's the Queen, the Astrid. Uh, well, I can't see it. Yeah, Astrid, Royal Astrid. So this is a hotel and this is what it says in this royal... There's the summer residence where the trees are of the King of Belgium. And this is what they say, the pharaohs. So this is really, this hurts. Exactly what they say, you know. <laughs> Nobody, they even put it in English, it's so horrible. It's it's a monarchy, and it's strange thing is the Belgians they the Belgians they speak uh, like uh, Dutch as far as I can understand it. Yes, it's, you know, the same way, the same soft way as the Luxembourgish people speak German. It must be the same people, therefore. 
the same lineage. Pharaoh. Pharaoh. Me. Sandals.